Today's to the point topic is light burn and how to create a coffee cup vector from scratch using a font. We're going to grab the text tool. We're using a font called Arco Typography, which is 100% free, and I'll drop a link down in the description. We're going to click and type the letter D. This font happens to be all caps, and then you can rotate that with either the comma or the period. Period clockwise, comma, counterclockwise. And we're going to stretch it out, right click, convert to path. And that will allow us to take this centerpiece out and delete it. Then we're going to type another D. Click the selector tool. Make it small. We're making the handle now. And we can right click on that one, convert to path, select this center, stretch it out make it look more like a handle grab it pull it into the cup select everything and then weld and to make it look like we have some steam coming out of the top we'll use another font so we'll go to the text tool we're going to select ballet harmony another free font that i'll drop a link for we're going to type a small S. This font happens to have caps and lowercase. And we're going to just grab it and set it into the top of the cup. Just rotate it around however you like to make it look like steam's coming out. We'll control D to duplicate and get us another one. Maybe flip it around the other way to give it a little different look. Pull it down. Select everything and weld it. Uh, then we'll grab a circle we'll draw out an oblong shape we're going to make this look like a saucer is under it and with it selected go over to the offset tool do a inner uh, offset let's do it about five millimeters click ok select it and group it together pull it up into your cup select everything and well there we are we have a cup made from scratch using a font so next time you want a vector you need a vector consider using some fonts that you already have check their shape and see if it's something that you can turn into what you need and that wraps up today's to the point topic.